Thank you. Thank you. So let's let the roasting begin. And I'd like to acknowledge a few people that are here from the district. First, I'd like to acknowledge Lynn Caduceus here. Lynn. Lynn! Uh, Lynn's been in Toastmasters for quite a while. In fact, her first uh, manual was written in papyrus. Is that right? <laughs> <laughs> she, uh, she saw Jesus' icebreaker and it was. Like... <laughs> <laughs> also, uh, heading up video is Michael Iman. Michael! Michael! Michael is the king of the pregnant pause. So, uh, yeah, that's right. His pictures on Planned Parenthood throughout the district. Crystal <laughs> <laughs> Palin follows him on Facebook. But we're hoping one of those pregnant pause will one day gives birth to a speech. So we're. <laughs> also, one of our newest members here is Surreal. Surreal, where are you at? Surreal! Surreal, so I wanted to give him a shout out. And um, you know, he's a French guy. Thank God we got another French guy so somebody understands what Christoph said. <laughs> Joyce! All right, so let's get on with this row, shall we? Yeah. Yeah. Right. Enough of me. Let's hear from let's hear from our next roaster. I have nothing bad to say about our first roaster. His name is Chris Hamill, but if you ever see a hamburger place called Six Guys, you'll know why. <laughs> Chris is a hamburger fiend. He eats more meat than Monica Lewinsky. <laughs> His favorite comic book character is Mayor McCheese. Please help me welcome Chris Hamill. speeches, mostly dealing with her bodily fluids, <laughs> including Ryan. <laughs> nice. She talked about being clumsy, falling downstairs, getting hurt in sleeping bags. That's not a mistake, that was plural, bags. That's two incidences. <laughs> Ryan is an artist. He draws, he paints, he composes music, and he colors. And some of his coloring has gotten really good. It has gone in a coloring book portfolio. And uh, it's, it's all over Maria's refrigerator door at home. <laughs> One night at Improv Masters, he did this really cool thing where he just, he can fall at will, just hits the ground. It's pretty spectacular. There's no joke there. But I'm going to use that information later. So I'm going to hopefully pay that off. Maybe it'll be worth it, kind of. Let's move on. <laughs> Over the past year, they're moving to Florida, so I've been sort of looking into Florida, trying to help you guys figure out what you might want to do while you're in Florida. So here's something that I found interesting. Florida has Gatorland. It's a 110-acre theme park and wildlife preserve that's billed as the alligator capital of the world. They have thousands of alligators and crocodiles and a boardwalk over a breeding marsh and a petting zoo. A petting zoo, you heard that right, a petting zoo. That seems pretty dangerous, but you guys should totally try that. Okay. Great. Ryan, Gatorland is currently looking for new employees. You have the skill set to apply as food. <laughs> you totally do that job. You can totally do that job. And the breeding area of the, of the park, the marsh, they use that in the filming of Indiana Jones and the Temple of Doom. Super cool. So you should go into the breeding marsh, see if there are any props in there. But do it on a work day so you can get paid if you don't make it out. <laughs> or maybe Gatorland isn't your cup of tea. Florida also has the Ringling Museum of Art, which includes the Circus Museum. That's the best of both worlds for Ryan. He can create beautiful pictures for the Museum of Art from a glass box on display in the sideshow exhibit of the Circus Museum. <laughs> it's either that or Gatorland, Ryan. 
I'll take that. Okay, fantastic. <laughs> you got to let them know sometimes, the ultimatums. Oh, here's something for Maria that you might enjoy. For the past 37 years, they've had the Miss Senior Florida pageant. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I mean, Ryan, I don't know how you feel about competing with your mom, but, but you are easily the top ten if you do that fake fainting thing. Yes, I paid it off. You see what I did there? Fake fainting thing. I told you I'd set that up at the beginning. Oh, that was worth the wait. Which is something Ryan hasn't gotten to say yet. But don't worry, buddy. You know, <laughs> I know, it's cool. It's cool. I heard the backstage of the Miss Senior Florida pageant gets pretty crazy. I think you guys are going to get along great in Florida. Ryan, someone is walking up to women near the University of Florida, urinating on them, and then taking off. So you'll already have friends with common interests when you get there. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. We all know you're a serial urinator. <laughs> you can hold it. Stay right there. Maria, you are a perfectionist who demands everything be fair. Last year, Florida Governor Rick Scott refused to go on stage for the first seven minutes of a debate because his opponent had an electric fan. And he did not. You guys are determined to be best friends. But seriously, I've had a great time getting to know you both. Maria, we butted heads a lot, but I've learned a lot from you about integrity and commitment. I mean, sometimes I wanted to say you were wrong about things, but in order to join the military, you took laxatives to cut weight. So I know better than to accuse you of being full of shit. <laughs> No offense, Ryan. I'm sure she wasn't pregnant with you at the time. <laughs> Double sorry. <laughs> Ryan just started a Facebook page called Rolling Sushi. He's planning to sell t-shirts. Find it and like it and buy his shirts. When celebs are, roll are wearing his gear, you'll be glad that you did. His artwork continues to evolve and grow. And you guys can find his site on Facebook and watch him grow more. Mm -hmm. I was going to insert a, a growing joke in there, and I thought, too dirty. I wish I'd done it now. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm going to miss you both, and I'm super jealous of whatever club gets to have you guys next. I know. Yeah. So, thanks. Yeah. All right, that wasn't so bad, right? <laughs> 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 Easing into this a little bit.